I don't want to know. Alright, there I go. I was sitting here trying to turn my headphones on for like the past two minutes or so. I need to get some new ones. They've been static in the recorders anyway. Damn, my leg. Did the Bucks get knocked out yet? Ah, rock with the Bucks. I don't think they got knocked out. Yeah, I'm tripping. They did. They still late. I just watched them yesterday. Or was it yesterday? Yeah, the Pacers or whatever day that was. That's why, man, I forgot the Bulls was, was knocked out, man. Because they went against the, the Magic. The Magic came out of nowhere. Ah, uh, you work at the Clippers? You know who they going against. They having trouble right now. <laughs> they they having trouble right now. You see it? You don't want to do that. You don't want to do this. What you mean they playing each other? Yeah. But you don't want to do this. But you don't want to do this. Oh, my goodness. I really don't feel like playing with the Mavs right now. But it's cool. I want you to play the, who you want to play with. Oh, they got Joe Jones starting. That's, I like that. I want them. I was gonna try and play with this other team. I was just on the Bucks. Tommy Maxey just missed mad free throws and then came through clutch. Nah, because before, right before that, he just missed like three of them shits. That's the crazy part. He missed three and he was hot at himself. And it really looked like it was over. Nah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, I ain't got a bottle of water in my mouth, John. Two NBA greats, Grant Hill and Steve Smith, our analysts tonight, with our reporter, Allie LaForce. I'm Brian Anderson. I like this court. <coughs> the discipline both of these teams exude is unique. It's really a testament to how well coached they are. They really are, B.A. Both have four teams. They like to slow the game down and execute their offense. Bro, why are you so I close to me? Respect to that kind of approach. Now here's Washington. Over Leonard. Oh man, why he? And it's off the back of the rim. No good. Under. Now there's this your tip. rim protection. That's how you defend the post. He did a nice job of keeping him off the block, then let him get deep post position. Surveying the D. Well, yeah, we got. Yeah, we need help on that. I need help. I need help. Help. And now the Mavs on the run. Denied by Leonard. Denied. Great effort by Kawhi. One of the best to ever do. Lock him up. Lock him up. Lock him up. Don't let him think he can take nothing. Outside Harden. Oh my. Beyond the arc. Hold on, my arm, my joystick. Here's Zubac. Yeah. Nah, man, we all. Don't hit his head. Hit the ball. Contested. The first one falls. You know, on a permanent basis, Avica Zubac is one of the top rebounders in the league, Smitty. BA, that's his primary role, along with setting good screens. He has the size, toughness, and instincts to excel at those responsibilities. All right, Grant, talking about Avica Zubac. What do you like most about his game? Well, just his defensive presence. I mean, he's willing to challenge shots at the rim, refusing to give anything easy. 
Basket's good. Oh, Luca is so skilled at using his body to create good looks inside. Good D. Here's Harden. Damn. Hits the layup after the sweet pump fake to freeze the D. Just taking it right to the rim, and no one was there to greet him. Wow, that's a defensive breakdown. Can't do that against good scores. So creative on the attack. I like whenever Doncic knifes inside and looks to score. Lock him up. Leonard, right good, side. Good, good, good help. Pass to Harden. Lock everything up. It's not real. Like we George said in Street outside. Fighter. That's not real. Just because that button can do that. That's not real. See? Washington grabs not a real, That's not a real opportunity. And it didn't register as an official block, but he did everything you want in disrupting that shot. You know what he did? He timed it well. I could have made that. I could have tried to really win. Without committing the foul. Thinking back to one of the most fun runs in the NBA, Grant, those early 2000 man. Mavs teams. Oh, I played against those teams. And Yo, Philly won, man. I'm tired of them, man. Good job, Philly. Of course, Steve Rash running the point. Dirk and Finley on the wings. And the pace they played with. Damn, I missed again. They were well ahead of their time. All right, now I'm about to focus. Season, Smitty, the Clippers were as busy as anyone at the trade deadline. Well, they came into the season with high Good job, Philly. But midway through, they I'm about to say, I better not let that go to overtime and it lose, man. To success, that would have been wild. They gave it a shot. So it's the Mavericks now. Pass to Doncic. Irving for three. Damn, this. It's rebounded by Zubats. On offense, here are the Clippers. Out to Leonard. We know everything, sir. And that's oh, good. his first bucket of the game. A that's a bag of shaking bait. Oh, get him out of here. Oh, he did the extras. His nimbleness makes him a unique threat at the rim. And here's Harden. He'll bring it up. Oh, but yeah, that's good. That. And he gets the bucket. Some guys I just understand how to me. generate I'm points. Like He's one, one, of one of them. Pass to Doncic. There's the triple. Paul George pulls down the board. Oh, man. The Clippers in the lead. Oh, no. Slow him down. Inside. Here's Leonard. Good D. Oh, it's blocked by Washington. Cut that Gucci lane out. Cut that what? Look. Second chance Why you foul him? And the officials whistle a no, foul no, on the no. shot. The bucket is good, and he'll go to the line. Just an all-star level talent. I mean, stopping Harden from scoring is almost an impossible task at times. That's good this from Harden. Just over three and a half minutes gone here in the first. Irving goes in. Lays it up and banks it in. Cutting to the rim with force. Once Kyrie sees an opening, he seizes it. Drives to the hoop. Oh, it's stolen by Doncic. And a fast break now. The Mavericks on the run. Here's Exum. Oh, man. Fuck your silly ass. A minute 58 left to play in the first. Pass to Harden. Clock at six. The D. The the block. Defense oh, at its oh, best from Doncic. Like to see him putting that much effort into his D. Not just swinging the ball around the perimeter. Aggressive move inside. Here's Exum. Here's Lively. That one falls. Poor interior ah. defense. If you play him soft, he's going to kill you. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Left side, Harden. I got him. To the middle. Man. And he Man, he ain't want to bang with this. And remember, James Harden is usually a front runner in the league in assist. He has great Damn, vision. why'd I do that? I said, Pale. Down low. Back 
Here's Leonard. And he drops it in from the low post. Leonard's got the second picking. bucket. That's the pass you want. Orchestrating the offense. Oh, no, but I want the I did push that to the right. One that will straight up. Oh, he nails that one. Three for four now. I was trying to hope you. tremendous hands are part of what makes Kawhi effective inside. That's why they call him the claw. Now here's Washington. No point so far. Here's Exum. Oh, he missed. It's deflected. And it's out of bounds. I had hope. by Zubox. Yeah, Mark. And the yeah, Clippers man. making a change here. Business, Mark. There's 31 seconds left in the first quarter of the game. Just five on the clock. He connects. Wow. And now he's I don't even know. In today's game. I can't Good explain execution. nothing. They're getting some short range looks here. I can't. Uh, I can't make it make sense. Here's Westbrook. Oh, I'll go. Okay. Washington with the ball. Oh, bro. Out of bounds. It'll be the first ball. Just past the Doncic like that. Why would I do that in this? Oh, damn. It is an eyeball. Yeah, I definitely got Russ back. So I've definitely been seeing him playing for us. And for those of you just tuning in, second quarter action is where we are. And a moment here to take a look at the scoring breakdown. More Los Angeles. Nice. Establishing a paint presence early in nice. the game. It really helps and pays big dividends down the line. It oh, ho, ho, ho. What he doing? One thing you can count Damn, on this is slick. They shoot threes all night long if you let them. I mean, near the top of the league for attempts beyond the heart. They do it every chance they can get. We got 10 20 left. We got a lot of ball games. Oh, 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 we're based on. Left side Tucker. Pass to Plumley. Mm hmm. Damn, bro. My fault, Kyrie. Gets fouled on the shot. One free throw coming his way. I wanted you to go up, not wow, really the reach. Vision of PJ Tucker made that play possible. And, and Mason Plumlee doesn't turn many heads in this play. He's a workhorse on the floor. Grant, he's a fantastic rebounder. Always has been. Underrated facilitator in the center spot. And he can fit into any team. That's out of bounds. Dallas will keep it. Check in with Allie LaForce. Well, Brian, in his 10th season in the league, Mason Plumlee started shooting left handed. He said, quote, it felt good changing, and the more I practice, it's just sort of my decision. It's about the result, and I'm happy I made the change. I don't even question it, and that's where I like to be. Brian? Well, it's working for him, whatever he's doing. Allie, good stuff there. Thank you. Here's Westbrook. Here he goes. Soft touch off the glass. Putting his head down and going to work. No. Westbrook won't let the contact stop him. Left side, Hardaway. Pass to Green. Back to 
serving. Six to shoot. Three pointer. They get the rebound. We are screwing you guys. Great job with the tip. Those are the kind of plays on the offensive glass that can tell you a lot about the player. Now here's Westbrook. Now here's Pumley. And stolen by Green. Into offense, every coach talks about it. Perfect example right there. That smooth finish off a terrific game. Man, the timing and execution couldn't have been any better right there. Beautiful patience by Lowy to up face. Westbrook comes out of here. That's the play. Big rebounded by Dallas. That's going up against a defense that knows the tendency. Damn, he got a big angle bracelet in there. And Grant, some players feel like certain officials have it out for him. Did you ever see any of that? You know what, BA? The refs are human too. Yes, I did say that. In there. Oh man, I was hopping a meter. We not really want to try to shoot. The D, damn. Westbrook. You got to step in front of him, boy. Uh, His second make in hard, five attempts. Hard, hard junior. Westbrook a little hard. Personally, he loves scoring on aggressive defense. Pass to Washington. Pass to Hardaway. Whoa. What's going on over there? Clippers making a change here. What's going on over there? Oh man. Oh, he stepped right into him. Damn. I peeped that. Give me. He like a shark coming down there. That nigga was about to bang with this. Come on. He passed. Oh, wow. I'm about to say. That's us. So we, we, we it was right there to play defense. Like, what he doing? And Dallas with possession. Doing the extras. A big stretch here. Audio. Ten to two. Extra it out. Back to Doncic. Oh, hold up. Got a piece of it. Oh, he stripped me. No, oh, I was about to dump it in. Leonard, right side. Absolutely not. Oh, great D. I was about to dump it in. The Mavericks trailing. Well, if you're the Clippers, are you out looking for the next Give me. young star friend? Possibly be it. I mean, five of their top six scores last year were over 30 years old. So they may need more production from your young guns to be a consistent contender. What are we doing? We right here. And so here are the Clippers. We are all ankle bases. Yeah. up a basket just a moment ago. Six on the shot clock. To the paint. Here's Zubats. And no good. Good D by Hardaway. Throws it up high. And the dunk to finish it off. A beauty. And once he gets to the rim, it's fairly automatic. Nothing fancy right there. Just takes his two points. Moves off. Substitution for your man. 116 left to play in the first half. Here's Harden. Into the lane. Second shot opportunity. Yeah, few guys do this as easily as Harden. Driving in hard and drawing a foul while taking the shot. 
Closer look here at the scoring breakdown for the Mavericks. Establishing a paint presence early in the game, it really helps and pays big dividends down the line because it frees up your perimeter. I'll tell you, he doesn't give points away. Excellent job from the line. Washington a screen to the inside. It's stolen by Leonard. And here's the fast break. Oh, and he can't cap off the break. A rare miss for him at point blank range. That's one he'd like to have back. It's tipped. Great awareness on defense there. Zubat's relishes blocking shots. Bad foul. That's not who you want to send to the line. No good on the free throw. He hits the second from the line. Such a versatile guard. James Harden is a triple double threat every single night. <laughs> that one falls for Powell. Second free throw, no good. Here's Man. Leonard up top. Here's Zubats. It's good! It's good at the buzzer! Wow! They credit him for understanding the situation and coming through. That is situational basketball. It takes a good understanding and good execution. And the first half comes to an end. We've got a close game going here. Clippers ahead. They're up by three. And don't go away. After the break, we'll see you right back here for the start of quarter number three. And after a fairly even first couple of quarters, this second half could turn out to be a great one as both teams trying to gain an edge. The Clippers in the lead. All right, let's get a report from Allie. Brian, with PG and Kawhi, the Clippers feel they have the talent to win it all. George said, quote, both of us internally had a promise to bring a championship here. This core has been here for years now, and when you look at the teams that win and are very successful, it's the teams that have been together, gel and connect. Brian? Yeah, that's the right philosophy there. All about health. Thanks, Allie. Here's Doncic. After the Clippers picking up a basket just a moment ago. Just three to shoot. Irving, no good. You know what? I like the flare, but you blew a layup. You know you've gone way too far. You know, when you think about Kyrie Irving's game, his ball handling is what still comes to mind first. Yeah, you know, B.A., that and his killer instinct. Kyrie is one of the most creative players we've ever seen. A guy you can count on to come through in big moments. Doncic, good. And when he puts it all together, look at the kind of night Luka can have. Wow. A little over a minute gone here in the second half. Now George. No good on the shot. Nice D from Gafford. Pass to Doncic. Inside. The rebound by Mann. And the Clippers with the ball. Outside for Harden. Takes the three. Yes, and it's George picking up the assist. Harden's got five points now in the quarter. Yes, yeah, so much of Harden's work happens at the top of the key. But he can also work you over from the corner. Luka proving he can score from anywhere. Bad idea leaving him open. He needs more defensive attention, not less. Kicks it to George. 
Back to Harden. The three. The Mavericks pull it in. And he lobs it up top. And stolen by Leonard. Oh, and the fast break for the Clippers. Oh, got a piece of it. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by George. Off on the timing, or it may have been a miscommunication. I try to throw it up to Kyrie. <laughs> A little under two and a half minutes gone by in the third quarter. Back to Gafford. Pass to Irving. On the take. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Now just a four-point Los Angeles lead. You always trying to answer back. Yo, this is the first time out. Damn. On and, on and, it, and it wasn't that big. Well, nah, I was fouling more Los Angeles man. decides to talk it over. Yeah, it's the first time out. That's crazy. But you always trying to answer back. I'll be having to watch on the next play. Because you might draw back all crazy. I'm like, damn, he's he trying, he trying to answer. Well, we're into the third quarter, just over two and a half minutes played. Pass to George. Clock at six. And Luka Doncic is going to pick up the foul. That's his first foul of the game. Hey. Hey. They got fire that riff after this. Westbrook taking his time here. Come on, bro. Yeah. Like Five on the clock. No. It's stolen by Irving. He saw the pass coming a mile away. And Washington powers it through. A tall guard who can see over the defense. Exxon with no trouble locating the open teammate. George. It was crazy. He had me jumping crazy. Down low. That pump fake down there in the paint like that was crazy. Yo, my players is all over the place, huh? What? Yeah, like, we all over the place. Y'all love um, just lollygagging in there. Pass to Irving. Don't go his own ass. Here's Washington. Oh, oh no. Oh no. And it's the Clippers on the That was not the answer we needed. Man, I'll be trying to sign you up by yourself. But help. Come on, man. And now a six point to lead. I'm screaming for your help. I'm saving for the hell. Now here's Dodger. Really? He's got 14. How that happen? He can't beat me on the one on one, so he can't beat me on the one on one, so we we know he ain't driving in on me and going crazy. Or nothing. Oh, he got that. Oh, he got that too. Damn. As the official calls the foul, count it, and he'll shoot one more at the line. Talking about the veteran Paul George, a star player, Smitty, wanting to compete for titles. B.A., he knows he's not getting any younger. I think it's good he poses this win-now mentality. He's clearly hungry to win a title. That's good from George. 
I like how Paul George can be your go-to guy, but he can also accept a secondary role. Very unselfish. Good look. The putback. Controls the rebound and the putback. He really gets in perfect position for the follow. Just a terrific read. Out of bounds as Los Angeles keeps possession. He was all over that pass. That's a cautionary tale. A little bit late there, but you try to get into your opponent's head. Force them to go somewhere else with the ball, and he did that. Pass to Westbrook. And here's Leonard. Jones with the block. Doncic on the wing to the middle. And that one is stuffed right through. You can tell Doncic trusts his teammates. He'll get them looks and doesn't insist on doing everything himself. The Mavericks trailing. There's a four-second difference from the shot clock and the game clock. Outside Hardaway. Driving inside. First team foul. Now at the line for your Mavericks, Tim Hardaway Jr. That one misses. Two shots. I'm not alarm. I'm not alarming. Good on the second one. Now here's Westbrook. Pass to Plumley. Leonard outside. Looking to get back on track. There's the block. And we've reached the end of the third. Clippers ahead, leading by four. Don't go anywhere. The final quarter is coming up next. Irving. Outside Hardaway. Called in by Brown. And so Brown will bring it up for Los Angeles. They've led by as many as 11. And there it is for him. Great timing. That can be the difference between an assist and a turnover. Westbrook with the miss. The Mavericks on offense. Trailing by two. Hardaway. Ooh, can't tie it up as that one's no good. Here's George. Another shot. Kick out to Brown. Going inside. Deflects the pass. And stolen by Green. To the inside. The shot is good, and this game is back to even. After being behind for so long, they must be relieved to finally get this thing tied up. Definitely. But this is the time when you want the momentum. Late is when you want to impose your will. Now here's George. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. With 3 5 to go. Over his career, Paul George has racked up more than his fair share of accolades, Grant. Well, he's a fixture at All-Star Weekend, that's for sure. Now, he's made the all-defensive team more than a few times. He's had an outstanding career. And he can't make the second free throw either. Missed them both. Rare sight. How often does he fail to capitalize at the line? Pass to Hardaway. Shoots over George. Oh, the go-ahead bucket, no good. I mean, he's trying to shoot his way out of what's becoming a prolonged cold streak. You know, to me, this is when you want to focus on creating for others. Give someone else a chance. It's called a teammate. 
Now here's Hardaway. Back to Green. Put it back, put it back. Pass to Hardaway. Outside for Irving. Here's Lively. Down low. Just five to shoot. Over Tucker. Oh, three chances on that possession, but they just can't find a way to score. Outside Harden. There's the drive. Can't hit from in close. He's going to tell me how to score, but he can't score. And they've been moving the ball really well tonight. Good things come to those who take good shots. Outside Irving. Washington outside. Irving with it. Harden picks him up. Oh, George with a steal. It's an even three-on-three -three break to stop the drought. Washington grabs the miss. And it's Hardaway on the take. Can't get the go-ahead bucket. Something's off about him this quarter. And it also shows you how difficult this game is. He's just a little bit off, but it can result in missing everything. Inside, Irving. Perfect pass to set up the lay-in. And the Mavericks lead by two. Kyrie has done it again. He loved the big shot and the big moment. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. Send it over to Allie LaForce. Guys, over the last break, I listened to Tyron Lue address the team. Coach telling their team, this is a tight one. We need full effort defensively. One or two stops, and we will win this game. Coach preaching defense, a familiar tune. Okay, thank you, Allie. Paul George loves these situations. The bigger the moment, the more he wants to deliver. And from the moment he stepped into the league, Luka's been a big-time player. And so here are the Clippers. After the Mavericks picking up a basket just a moment ago. George feels it out a bit. Pass to Harden to take the lead. The Mavericks pull it in. You know, we talk a lot about scoring efficiency. He's displaying the exact opposite. Now here's Hardaway. Fires for three. It's rebounded by Zubats. Surprising to see him miss here. But they'll be happy with that shot in most possessions. The Clippers trail. And here's Harden. Pass to man. To the paint. Here's Zubats. And Gafford with the block. Tries again. No good off the glass. And so it's Dallas with it. A great fourth quarter. Just giving up two points. Hard away with it. Back to Irving. Pass to Hardaway. Six on the shot clock. On the wing, Irving. Shoots over Harden. Beat the shot clock, but it's off the mark. Hard to create space in that mid-range area. He would have been better passing that off. I mean, unbelievable. It's one thing to be talented, but Kawhi is clutch as well. Now here's the shot. Count it! There is absolutely no fear in his eyes. He loves the moment. Incredible shot with everything on the line coming through for his team. Knowing the situation, Kawhi willing and able to take control. Big bucket. There's 39 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Doncic 
deciding where to go with it. Oh. Effort. Yes! Rise up and flush it, big man. If he wanted to, he could have ripped the rim off the backboard on that one. And Leonard, here we go. Attacking under pressure. Way to go, Zubox. Here's Dallas now. Irving with it. Down low. Here's Gafford. Count it! And they aren't over the limit yet. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. They're behind by two. 11 seconds left to play in the fourth quarter of this one. All right, guys, what's your take? More than enough time to get a bucket. But I'm curious to see, will they go for a two to tie or a three to win it all? That press on them. The newspaper. That other people. For that issue. 11 seconds left to play in the fourth. Incredible. Russ is made for the big moment. And Dallas calls time here. as we get going in overtime. Neither team giving an inch in this game. It's George on the wing. To the middle. Pass to man. Here's Leonard. George outside. Five to shoot. And here's Zubats. It's stolen by Doncic. Inside. Here's Gafford. And the dunk by Gafford. On time, on target. Kyrie orchestrating things beautifully. And Leonard throws it down hard. Well, we know Leonard's an elite two-way machine, but there he shows us the artistry. Pocket six. Launches it. Second chance effort. And finished off by Gaffer as he lays it in. And the Mavericks lead by two. Activity on the glass. That's a possession that, that could have gotten away from me. That was the top of my meter. That was like my best three I took all day. Screen. Make that level. Leonard, right side. Here. Man, that shot was wide open. I thought he was about to blink that. The Mavericks on offense. Here's Irving. Get him out of here. Let him play on D. And the layup is good. And now a four-point Dallas lead. I wanted to end it, but I was trying to like it. To the inside. I wanted somebody to be in the back door. Huge points from Zubats. His size helping him in these big possessions. Zubats comes with a double team. And here's Dodgers outside. Laces one from three. Clutch play by 
by Doncic. He's been doing this since he was a kid. He told us that he's been doing this as a kid. Now George. Oh. Now here's Leonard. Yeah, like right, Pass to Harden. From downtown. And it's Irving with a rebound. Yeah. And so they foul intentionally. A chance here to pass. Oh, Sean, pass it to Luca. Get it through. Oh. Remain focused to get it done. He gets the first, and that increases the lead to six. Watching Kyrie Irving, you can just see how special he is. His moves, how light on his feet he is. It's really a thing of beauty. And so he drops them both, and it's a seven-point game. Making the most of his trip to the line and helping them extend their lead. And he buries it. And now they trail by just four. <laughs> and there is no way anybody else is taking that shot. I mean, when it's crunch time on a big possession, Harden is always going to be that guy. Two shots. He hits the first one, and that puts him up five. So he gets them both, and it's a six-point ball game. And looking for a quick bucket here. They have very little time to run a play, and then, of course, they also need to foul. And that's an intentional foul. Now at the line for your Mavericks, Luka Doncic. Two shots. Good on the first, and that makes it a seven-point lead. And when we talk about franchise players, guys who can carry a team, Luka Doncic is one of the few guys in that category. Second one is good, getting both at the line. And it's an eight-point ball game. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. They trail by eight. 17 seconds left in overtime. Guys, what do you think? They just haven't put it all together tonight. They are left picking up the remains of their game plan. Better luck next time. Football pass. Now we know Harden possesses <laughs> endless range, letting it all hang out right there. A little size, but has the bounce to hold his own. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. They're trailing by seven. We've got 13 seconds left in the first overtime period. All right, guys, what do you think? And time's running short. They just couldn't get over that hump. I just think they have to focus on the moment. Don't worry about the score. You worry about executing the next play. <laughs> and this dude draining them, yo. He's never shy to let it go from three-point range. He's draining them. He wants to make the deep job as tough as possible. And they stop the clock as soon as they can with the intentional foul. about to get T-man up out of here. No choice but to foul in that situation. Although, that's not the guy you want to send to the free throw line. He drops the first one, and that puts him up five. I got some free throw on this, and I ain't missing. I just He's missed. off on the free throw, unable to get the second one to drop. Yeah, they're going to step back. <laughs> he, what, he took that bad shot. He should have been the best. It was touch and go there for a while, but in overtime, they caught a second win. Kyrie. They really did, and it James was hard. Everything it took just to get to the extra period, and then their surge at the end. Ooh. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Steve Smith. Out. 24, I had 20, okay, 23, 15. Some pretty decent stuff yet. Yeah. yeah. I had one three. He had like, ooh, that was James Harden with all them threes too. I didn't even know that. 
I didn't even know that. Okay. Nice.